What's up guys? It's uh, My Runner Opinion and I have a spike review for you today. Uh, this this uh, spike review has been done like a lot of times but I thought I'd just try and make it a little bit more easy or simple for people that are just starting to race or um, they just want to get some information on whether they want to buy the spike or not. So um, I've broken this up into three different categories which is uh, general information, di distances, and events and if I would recommend them. So today you're doing the Nike Zoom Victory and these are the 2012 model. I don't know if that really has anything to do with it but um, these are 3.2 ounces well they are for a men's size 9 so I don't know how much the weight of or how much the size affects the weight I don't know if it's too drastic or anything like that but uh these utilize the Nike Flywire technology as you can see I don't know if that's like true or not because um I thought it was just kind of a gimmick of Nike's like because now that they've actually come out with like the Nike Zoom Victory Elites and the Nike Matumbo 2 they actually have like the actual straps on the side that like when you lace it it actually gets tighter around your foot so I don't really know for sure or not, but I um, guess you're just going to have to take their word for it. This also uses the Nike um, Zoom technology, which puts the midfoot or the forefoot a little bit closer to the ground than the heel, so it really makes you get up on your toes. Well, not legitimately your toes, but your midfoot when you run, so you'll be, you'll be feeling it a little bit faster than, uh, I guess, everyone else. And then on the bottom, uh, shark skin which is like pretty nice it's uh I don't really know how I'd give the material a rating it's really uh, like prickly at first and like I guess gives a lot of traction but as it as you use them more that it starts to wear down so I guess also these shoes for durability I think they're pretty durable I've had these for two cross-country seasons and uh, one season of track so the only thing that's really happened is they started to rip right there, which is pretty common. And then also the the heel. The heel's starting to fall apart, which I don't think is too big of a deal. I also I always see like people's like uh, getting spiked or it starts to rip apart up here, so I guess I was just lucky with that. So now moving on to distances. For track, these are best used for the eight hundred through the five thousand meters. Or in high school, I don't know if everyone runs, I don't really know what everyone runs in high school. I think it's just different all throughout the country. But for me, we only have, for distance, it's 800 through the 2 miles. So you could use these through both or all. Also, I've heard of people like using these in the 400 or the 100 even. But I think it'd just be more useful to buy like a real sprinting spike. These are more of a mid-distance spike, but you can use them for longer events. I've used I've used these for cross country, like I've said. The only thing that you would like want to watch out for in cross country is that they don't have as much support as some other cross country shoes. So I don't and like they can get kind of uncomfortable maybe if you're not wearing socks and like if you don't midfoot strike because you can start to get blisters. But I guess that's all preference. I never really wore socks with mine, so and I was I was pretty much okay the whole time. So I would give these a yes for cross country, as long as you're as long as you know like if you'll be okay in them or not. I know a lot of people use them for cross country, so I I'd, I'd give them a a thumbs up for cross country and for like track. And would I recommend these? Yes, these or like a really really nice shoe like I I was used to I was used to running in the Matumbos and when I tried these on it was like a whole different world like I felt a lot faster because I guess the in, instead of four spikes you had six so I don't know it just felt more aggressive so and I could hold I could hang on to those turns like really fast turns a little bit a little bit better so yeah Nike Zoom Matumbo or <laughs> Nike Zoom Victories.